What if I told you that soon you could be going on vacation in space? I'm not talking about stargazing through a telescope or a virtual reality experience. I'm talking about boarding a spaceship, crossing the atmosphere, and within hours, floating up there in space, seeing Earth like never before. Sounds like a far-off dream, right? Well, this vision is closer to reality than most people think. What's driving this revolution? Nuclear propulsion. Today, the idea of space travel is something limited to billionaires and astronauts. The few missions that reach space, typically using conventional chemical rockets, require massive investments, complex technology, and long travel times. But nuclear propulsion can change all that. With a much more efficient thrust capacity, this technology is the key to making space tourism accessible, fast, and even safer. If you're curious to understand how this innovation can transform the future of travel and allow more people to experience space, stick with me. In the next few minutes, we'll explore how nuclear propulsion could usher in a new era of space tourism, making it as real as a transatlantic trip. Before we talk about the future, it's important to understand what makes current space tourism so restricted. Traditional space travel, which relies on chemical rockets, faces nearly insurmountable challenges to becoming accessible. First of all, the travel time is long. Any mission beyond Earth's orbit requires months of transit, making a simple visit to other planets a complex and exhausting task. Imagine spending more time traveling than actually enjoying the destination. Another critical issue is the exorbitant cost. Currently, each trip to space costs millions of dollars, limiting access to just a few individuals. Even with advancements in space technology and the entry of private companies into the sector, most space travel remains restricted to the ultra-wealthy. This model makes space tourism practically unfeasible for the general public. This is exactly where nuclear propulsion comes in as a revolutionary solution. By reducing travel time and potentially lowering the cost of each mission, it can open the doors to a much more inclusive form of space tourism. And this isn't just a theoretical idea. Nuclear propulsion is on the verge of transforming the way we explore space. So how exactly can nuclear propulsion solve these challenges? Let's take a closer look at the power behind this technology. Nuclear propulsion is based on nuclear reactions that generate an enormous amount of energy. Instead of relying on chemical fuel, which is heavy and inefficient for long distances, nuclear propulsion uses nuclear reactions to produce a much more intense and long-lasting thrust. This means that a spacecraft equipped with this technology can reach far greater speeds than any conventional propulsion system. To give you an idea, with current chemical engines, a trip to Mars would take about nine months. With nuclear propulsion, that same journey could be completed in less than half the time. This ability to cut travel time makes space tourism more practical and safer. And it doesn't stop there. Because nuclear propulsion allows spacecraft to travel faster and carry less fuel, there's more space to transport passengers and cargo, which can significantly reduce the cost of each mission. Moreover, this technology enables greater flexibility in routes and potential destinations. With a faster spacecraft, the options for destinations in space multiply. Trips to the Moon, Mars, or even to space stations orbiting Earth become much more viable and attractive for future tourists. Nuclear propulsion isn't just a technological advance. It's the engine that could take space tourism to a new level, bringing this experience much closer to our everyday lives. With nuclear propulsion, space tourism becomes possible for many more people than we might imagine. This technology not only cuts travel time, but also makes more frequent launches feasible, allowing space companies to expand their operations and, over time, offer more affordable prices. Imagine a future where booking a trip to space could be done as easily as reserving a cruise or a plane ticket. Beyond accessibility, the experience itself is something extraordinary. Picture yourself floating in zero gravity, feeling weightless, seeing the curvature of the Earth and the brilliance of the stars without any atmospheric interference. 
These are experiences that were once reserved only for astronauts, but with nuclear propulsion, they could be offered to ordinary people on a much larger scale, and this accessibility isn't as unprecedented as it might seem. Look at the history of aviation. What began as an expensive luxury for a select few is now accessible to millions of people worldwide. Nuclear propulsion gives space tourism the potential to follow the same path, transforming this exclusive experience into a real option for a much broader audience. So, here's the question. Would you be among the first to embark on this new era of travel? With nuclear propulsion expanding the possibilities, the future of space tourism promises to be much more exciting and varied than just short trips around Earth. With this technology, new destinations are coming closer to reality, where you could choose between different space packages, including trips to the moon, orbital tours around Mars, or even stays in future space stations where you could spend days, or perhaps even weeks, gazing at the cosmos. These new route options not only broaden the reach of space tourism, but also encourage the development of a more robust infrastructure in space. Space stations and even bases on other planets could be built to welcome tourists and support scientific exploration, creating an ecosystem where tourism and research advance side by side. This progress would open up a range of experiences that today seem unimaginable for most of us. Going to space could become as diverse as choosing between an adventure trip and a relaxing vacation. And all of this might be closer than we think, thanks to the innovation of nuclear propulsion. The implementation of nuclear propulsion in space tourism brings challenges and ethical questions that cannot be ignored. As promising as it is, this technology involves nuclear materials, raising concerns about safety. Ensuring there are no leaks or malfunctions is essential, especially considering the impact an accident could have on the space environment and on passengers themselves. In addition to technical risks, there are environmental and ethical issues to consider. Space is a natural, and so far, largely unexplored environment, but increased human activity, even in orbit, brings potential impacts to the sustainability of the cosmos. These aspects raise important questions. How far is it safe to expand tourism into space? Are we ready to manage this kind of advancement responsibly? With so many advances underway, the big question is, when will space tourism with nuclear propulsion actually be available? While there isn't an exact date yet, many estimates suggest we're just a few years away from this reality. Scientists and engineers at places like NASA and private companies are already developing and testing nuclear propulsion prototypes that could soon be applied to space missions. The next few years will be crucial for testing and perfecting this technology. Many experts believe that as soon as nuclear propulsion proves to be safe and efficient, space tourism could become a viable option for far more people. Imagine that, within a decade, Booking a ticket to space could be as natural as booking a transatlantic flight. What once seemed like a science fiction fantasy is getting closer to becoming part of our daily lives. With nuclear propulsion, we're entering a new era where the boundaries of space are no longer unreachable but are possible destinations. Imagine a future where vacations in space are as common as international travel. That's the reality that technology is shaping for us. Share your thoughts in the comments and let us know if you'd take a journey like this. One that promises to change the world. See you in the next video.